so yeah so this lion king snow globe uh sold um sold for full asking price Yo, what's going on everybody? Yo, what is good? Yo, it is your boy, the Georgia Picker. Yo, what's going on everybody? Yo, hopefully everybody had a great weekend. Um, I had an interesting weekend. Um, let's just leave it at that. Um, but today is Sunday and it's actually very, it's almost the next day. It's uh, 9 o'clock at night on the 11th. It is Sunday. Uh, and we have uh, 14 packages to ship out for $219 and some change. Um, overall, we got some pretty good really dope stuff uh, that I sold and then we got a handful of things that are just kind of you know not so much you know uh, profit and then we got some stuff that, that has some uh, some decent profit so and uh, I have not listed anything that we got over the weekend and that is on me but I mean we had so much stuff to do this weekend it was kind of insane so uh yeah so let's just go ahead and get started um so like I said we got 14 packages going out and the very first one going out is going to be Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 2. And it's right here. And this sold for $11.49 free shipping. So not, not, a, not a too uh, expensive deal there. But at the end of the day, we are making some profit on that. Next thing going out is going to be uh, Gears of War 1, the collector's edition. Um, and then the regular version of 2 and 3. I've had this on there probably for a few months. I kind of figured, I was like, you know what, I, I would take $20 for it just because I'm in the profit on it. Uh, but yeah, this sold for $20 to $19.99 plus shipping. Uh, but this is the Gears of War 1 Collector's Edition, and then there's just the regular versions of 2 and 3. So, pretty cool to see some video game stuff go out. <clears throat> Next thing going out is going to be a Funko Pop. It's going to be Unmasked number 51. Yeah, so this is right here. This is Batman Unmasked number 51. He sold for $10 plus shipping. And he does have a small dent in the back, and we did make sure to enclose that. And it still sold for $10 bucks plus shipping. <clears throat> Next thing going on is going to be a PlayStation 2 controller. It's going to be in C3. Um, I'm pretty sure it's this right here. Already got it. Yep, there it is right there. I'm going to pull it out real quick so you guys can see it. Uh, but this sold for $14.99 plus shipping. Well, yeah, look at that. This thing is mint condition. It's so beautiful. Um, but uh, yeah, so $14.99 plus shipping. $20.34 all in. All right, so this one was actually kind of surprising. Uh, I've had this out there for about two weeks. Um, if you guys remember the garage sale where I got like a box filled with like, DVDs and CDs, uh, the nice lady let me have it literally for 5 bucks. Uh, but then I'd spent a total of 15 bucks there. It's where I got the handcrafted ornaments from Dillard's. Uh, some Dakin stuff, just a bunch of stuff like that. We're already in the green on that deal. Um, and this is kind of icing on the cake because if you guys remember um, all those DV, uh, all those CDs, uh, a lot of them I couldn't really do anything with. Um, they didn't really go for much, and I couldn't really lot them up together because they were kind of scratched up. A lot of them were scratched up. Uh, but this right here is a lot of 19 CDs, and uh, all of them being Christmas themed. I know Christmas was right around the corner, so I was like, you know what? Let me just see if I can put them up there, see what somebody will, you know, somebody would uh, take them. So, a lot of 19 Christmas CDs mixed, and the thing is, I didn't put a skew on it. I did not put a skew on it, so I have no idea where this is. So, I don't know if I put them in here. I forgot about this. I think I put this here because I knew it was going to be here, but let's see. Yes, there it is. 19 Xmas CDs. Um, obviously you guys can't see it, but I got this all packed up. Um, but you guys will see a thing on the screen. Uh, and this sold for $14.99 free shipping, and this will go medium mail. All right, next thing going out is going to be another one of those uh, drill bits that I got from Trips Storage Unit. Uh, it's going to be in D1. It's going to be an Irwin, Irwin one inch auger bit, and that's what it's going to be right there. There it is. This one's kind of a thick. It's a thick drill bit too. So. This sold for $5.99 plus shipping, $12 all in on the drill bit. Next thing going out, I remember uh, getting this at a uh, yard sale. I literally got it for like a dollar. Uh, not crazy amounts of profit here. Um, but I got it because it was brand new and it's a stud finder. It's a Zircon stud finder. It's going to be a C1. And this is what's going to be right here. It's going to be a Zircon uh, stud finder. So this thing's brand new. And uh, I had it out there for $9.99. And somebody offered seven dollars, so then I was like seven ninety nine at yours, so they accepted. So seven seven nine yeah, seven ninety nine free shipping. So like I said, not a not a crazy amount of money, probably making about two dollars off of it, but 
Either way, it's a sell, and I'm happy. Next thing going on is going to be another uh, video game. It's going to be uh, Splinter Cell Blacklist for the PS3. So this right here, uh, probably was on my store for about two weeks. Uh, this sold for $5.49 free shipping. So probably get a couple bucks off of that. Not too much though. Um, this one's uh, kind of surprising too. Um, so I remember going to one garage sale probably a month and a half back. Not anything crazy. Um, from watching YouTube videos, a lot of people say Avon stuff will go for some great money. Some of it, of course. And um, this particular item is a Avon uh, cologne spray. And um, I picked it up. I literally got it for a dollar. Uh, it's very easy to ship out. It's going to be in D3. But yeah, it's brand new. Um, this is from 2016. Uh, Avon stuff. Sold for $8 free shipping. So not a whole lot. It'll go first class and is very lightweight. All right, next thing going on is going to be, uh, I literally just listed this uh, not too long ago. If you guys remember those uh, Craftsman 18-volt batteries, um, I tested them. I made sure the charger worked. The charger charged them up all the way to green. Uh, and uh, I put them up there for $34.99 free shipping. And uh, somebody uh, rebuttaled with uh, a different price, and I'll show you guys that in a minute. But um, I've been putting these in the loft, which I'm get right here, literally. So this is what it is. Um, this is a Craftsman 18 volt battery. Um, a lot of people are switching over to the 20 volts. That's one thing I've learned. Um, but this is my first time actually ever buying 18 volt batteries. Um, I got a box of like six of them, not not just the batteries, but some of them were chargers. And then I got a few of these different battery type stuff, and then the charger for that as well. Um, and they're charged up good, and they work. And I got the whole box for 10 bucks. So uh, this right here sold for 30 dollars free shipping so not bad not bad so definitely in the, in the deal, uh, green on that deal all right next thing going out it's gonna be farming simulator 15 ps4 game drum was gone that's literally uh, all we got we got two more left uh so farming simulator 15 sold for ten dollars free shipping all right uh, i haven't sold one of these in probably about a week and a half um but it's one of those uh marvel game reverse uh you know like type things that i have over here that's where i put my my gopro backpack uh, but yeah, I have over a hundred of these, as you guys can see, have a lot of them. <laughs> so uh, this sold for nine dollars free shipping. Um, after each one of these sales, I'm probably making about three dollars profit on each one, and uh, so I'm happy with that. Next thing going out is going to be an Irwin quarter inch by eight, 18 inch drill bit. It's going to be an A3. And the drill bits are definitely selling though. I think it's really cool, and uh, I think this is my last one of these let's see yeah so this right here sold for $6.99 plus shipping 14 I'm sorry $11 all in on the drill bit. you guys remember a few weeks ago I bought some uh, snow globes I bought like some digital timers um, and I bought like a Sony dream machine uh, clock radio clock um, I got the snow globe for five dollars and one of them sold and it's gonna be an e3 so yeah so this Lion King snow globe uh, sold um, sold for full asking price uh, I, I've never bought snow globes before but Lion King is part of my childhood so uh, the reason why I bought it is for the fact that I mean I figured it went more you know went more for you know more than five dollars so uh, this sold for $29.99 free shipping so and this probably gonna cost about eight bucks to ship out but this was extremely cool don't be afraid to buy snow globes christmas right around the corner too um little kids love them uh they play music and stuff and uh yeah we bought two snow globes and we only spent 20 bucks there uh in total the radio already sold um and uh that just sold there so we're back in the green on that deal um but yeah that's everything that's going out so your boys gotta get the packing because they're going to be going out first thing in the morning um but yeah, we have a lot of stuff to uh, to list. Um, as you guys see, we still got the, the chargers and stuff to list. I'm going to take you guys in here real quick. Um, but we've had some obligations this week, uh, this weekend, so we still have everything in here to list. And your boy needs to get busy because, yeah, <laughs> it's just, it, we just got to get busy. We still got comic books, man. We still got all this stuff. I mean, it's, it's starting to take over. Um, however... We have plenty of inventory, all that stuff. So even if I did take a week off from going to garage sales, we, we would be perfectly fine with listing. However, it's getting colder. So that means garage sales aren't really going to be coming around too much more. 
So we're trying to hit them all up as much as we can before it starts getting really cold and nobody wants to do a garage sale. <laughs> so, uh, but yeah, that's it for me, you guys. We will see you guys next video. It's your boy, Georgia Picker, the Young Jedi. Everybody have a great weekend. Peace.